Hey everyone, Dan from On One here. I wanted to show you some cool changes that we're working on for the filter stack inside of Effects for On One Photo 10. You notice that things look a bit different than it did in the past, but you can still work the same way, plus we've given you some cool new ways to work. I've opened this landscape image and I'm going to show you how I would stack filters to create the look that I want. You can start by using either the presets or the filter settings over here on the left hand side, or you can just manually stack filters on the right. I'm going to click the Add Filter button, which pops up a list of all the available filters. And then I can just click on one that I want to use. Let's say I'm going to start with Dynamic Contrast. You notice that when I select Dynamic Contrast that the Add Filter list rolls up and the new Dynamic Contrast filter is added in place. You also notice over on the left that the filter previews have changed to the Dynamic Contrast category. So I can visually see thumbnails of all the different options that are built in, or on the right, I can dial in the settings as I want to. I'm just going to pick the natural option and maybe I'll adjust the large setting up just a little bit to my own taste. Then when I want to add another filter on top, I simply click on the add filter option again. Let's say this time I want to use the color enhancer to make the greens look more green. So I'll just select the color enhancer. There we go. You'll notice that again, the add filter list has rolled up, the color enhancer is selected, and below that is the dynamic contrast filter. It still stacks filters just like it did before, but now I can see the options inside of each pane. And again, the category on the left has changed to the color enhancer, so I can view all of the built-in options. I'm just going to use the green enhancer option to automatically enhance my greens. There we go. Let's stack one more filter. I can go back to the right, click on Add Filter, and this time I want to add a vignette. I'll select Vignette, and again, Previews on the left, or Options on the right, where I can adjust it either way. I'm going to grab the Big Softy. All of the filters in the filter stack work just like the individual panes that you were used to seeing in Portrait and Enhance. I can open and close them, I can turn them on or off, and I can drag them to change their order. Simply click on the filter that you want to adjust to reveal its options. If you want to mask a filter, just click on the mask icon in each filter to reveal the mask section where you can then use any of the masking tools to selectively paint in or paint out a filter. You can also click on the blending options gear to see the blending options where you can apply the filter to just certain color or tonal ranges. There you have it, a quick tour of the new filter stack in effects in On One Photo 10. Thanks for watching.